Missoula is it's a great place to live. It's 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 blue. It's it's green. It's beautiful. Um, we're very open, open, very welcoming. Um, it's a lot of weird people, but in the best possible way. Oh, I think that it's more walkable than Uh, raised in the district, voted for Zoe. Um, yeah, and it's it's been. It's been an interesting, I mean, I'm very like proud of her and the work that she's doing. So the bill she was silenced on was Senate Bill 458, which defines male and female and writes us out of Montana code. And now it's headed to the governor's office to be signed and put into law. I personally have never met her, but um, I know that we're in like the same age bracket and we have like the same belief system, so I think it's a really powerful thing to watch kind of unfold. Um, but the most, like the recent happenings have just been infuriating and... Um, I do know that she's been like pigeonholed and um, wrongfully silenced and it just feels very unconstitutional and if somebody else would have said this, they probably wouldn't have even batted an eye. I vacillate between hopelessness and between rage because it's like, I feel like we're fighting this huge monster and it's wearing us down and the other part of me says, well, then you rise up and you keep fighting. You, you know, these are your lives that we're, you're fighting for.